Hi, this is Sean, Foster SC Mods, and I want to go over the uh, part of the diaphragm cap here that some applications have an issue with, and that's a vibration uh, coming from the intake and the supercharger. It really has, most of the time, nothing to do with the cap. It has to do with um, the intake itself and the supercharger and something that may be causing a resonance in there that uh, ends up making a vibration sound. So uh, first uh, I'll just uh, talk about what can happen uh, when you're installing the cap, especially on the uh, 2005 to 2014 uh, Roush VMP and GT500s. Uh, the way it fits under the dash, sometimes forcing the cap in. Um, the diaphragm clear membrane here that's tight and it should be tight gets loosened um, by forcing it in people end up pushing hard on this cap and it creates slack so this membrane here is pliable and the membrane uh, will actually bend and flex and is very durable the only way it'll break is if a sharp edge uh, pushes uh, or hits it and then it'll it'll it, it can cut it and puncture it but you can see how hard I'm pressing on this and it doesn't uh, puncture so it's pretty durable but it can it can get loose and if it gets loose that can also cause a vibration so what you can do is you can tighten it up simply by using a hair dryer and what you want to do is you just want to use kind of a waving motion with a hair dryer you don't want to hold it on there because you can burn a hole through it so you just kind of wave it. And you can see right there, it's tight again. So the second way you can stop this uh, vibration is by just taking a cotton ball, simply taking a small piece of it off like this. I've got a couple chunks that I've taken out and you don't need much. Basically, what you're trying to do is create a little bit of resistance on the membrane to keep it from flexing and vibrating. Scotch tape works really good, and you just simply tape it on, and it doesn't have to be tight at all. In fact, uh, slightly loose is good, so it's just putting a little bit of pressure to stop this vibration. So you can see... It's fairly loose. You can you can even you know kind of see through it here on the other end, and that's enough to stop it from causing this uh, vibration. Sound can sound like a rattle, depending. Uh, not not many cars have this problem at all. It happens every once in a while, and this is a really easy way to fix it. And then I also recommend that you watch my video um, on my tricks tricks and tips. Uh, videos under the videos tabs on my website and that talks about how to install this cap um, very easily using a screwdriver and uh, a method by tilting it up in place in the sound tube under the dash and then using the screwdriver to push it in kind of like right under here and um, that really helps to, to get it in easily without you know muscling this in and, and sometimes deforming the uh, and loosening the uh, diaphragm membrane.